Hey, what is going on guys? My name is Shivani and welcome back to another video on Hypixel Skyblock and today I will go over update 0.6 that has been released uh, roughly 15 minutes ago and I decided to go over every single thing that's actually in the game. Now, um, sorry that I'm kind of quiet but it's uh, currently 12.15am so I actually need to go to sleep but I still wanted to push this uh, update log out for you guys. So the first thing, um, you can now visit other player islands with slash visit, but that's currently um, disabled until they have fixed everything that has uh, to do with it. And basically the higher rank you are, um, the more players that can go on your island. So I could do slash visit and somebody's name. So symbolism, um, but that feature is still upcoming. So that's probably one of the biggest things now in the game. If you have one VIP on your island, you can have three guests if you have one MVP on your island. The guest limit is five, and if you have one MVP++, the max amount of guests on the island is seven. Now, the next big thing is a really good thing, in my opinion. Um, they changed how bosses work. So the magma boss, you could basically kill the magma boss and then steal it, but they changed, uh, you know, the mechanics for the loot. Um, bosses still drop the items on the ground, but you can only see your own loot like, uh, from what you have gotten so far. And the more damage you deal to the boss, the more uh, loot you will get. So this basically means if you deal a whole bunch of damage, you will probably get a whole bunch of items. Uh, but it doesn't mean that you get the best item in the game. Uh, but overall, a whole bunch of damage basically means um, a whole bunch of items and probably the best ones in the game. Uh, so they added a few new items in collections as well. So the first one is the woodcutting crystal. Um, so it can be placed on your private island and increases the speed of nearby foraging minions by 10%. Um, this crystal is kind of useless in my opinion because why would you want minions for foraging? But um, who cares anyway? Then the next one is in the redstone collection. And if we go to redstone collection, we can see that uh, we have the greater talisman bag. And you need 200,000 redstone for that. Uh, but it will give you 21 slots instead of 15. Then uh, we have a new one in Sand, Sand 7. It's a hard glass recipe. It's special hardened glass, which doesn't break to explosions. So you can use this one when you have ghost farms. Um, and then probably one of the best uh, new items in the game is the hot potato book. And uh, we will go over this right now. So you guys go to farming and you guys go to potato. Then uh, potato 8 is hot potato book, which you need 50,000 um, potatoes for that. And it's actually quite expensive anyway. Um, you need um, 32 times 5 uh, enchanted potatoes for enchanted baked potato and it gives you one hot potato book. Combine this book in an anvil with a weapon or armor piece to gain a small but permanent stat boost. Um, for weapons you get 2 damage and 2 strength and for armor pieces you get 2 defense and 4 HP and you can stack up to 10 books so that means it for an item you can get a total of 20 damage and 20 strength and for armor pieces you can get 20 def defense and 40 HP. So if you do that on for armor pieces you guys can already see that you're going to get 160 extra HP on top of your set bones. Then uh, the next big thing that they did is they made leaderboards finally. If you go to skills and you go to uh, the second diamond sword you guys can see uh, what level you are currently and your ranking overall. So you guys can see that my farm ranking is 20,000 of 517,000 players, blah, blah, blah. So my mining is actually quite good. It's five point, it's like 6,000 of 517,000 players, blah, 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 blah. Uh, my enchanting is actually pretty good. I'm in the top 0 0.5 players. Then the next thing that they added is telekinesis, and that's a new enchant that you can put on swords, bows, pickaxes, um, basically every single um, tool in the game. And whenever you mine an ore, uh, or you do basically anything with an item, uh, the loot goes straight into your uh, inventory. So there's no more stealing with a magnetic talisman if people have disenchant on, let's say, their fishing rod. Another big thing in 0.6 is the enchanted book recipe changes. So you used to be only able to get uh, level one books from just crafting them, and Hypixel thought that was a bad idea. So now you're able to get higher level books. So let's say for Spider, um, you could only get Venomous 1, but now you can get the Venomous 4 book. So it costs more, uh, but at least you get the Venomous 4 book instead of like a useless Venomous 1 and then needing to combine it. Um, that's basically the same for every, uh, every book in the game. 
Uh, most of them were level one and they're now level four, um, or they're at level, they were level one and now they're level two. One thing I almost forgot to mention is there is now a teleport pad trade. Uh, it places a teleport pad down, allowing you to teleport to any other teleport pad on your private island. Um, it costs one enchanted eye of ender and you get two teleport pads, so you basically can go from one location to another. Um, but I almost forgot to throw that in the video, but that's now a thing. Um, I'm gonna grind for an enchanted eye of ender and show you guys uh, how to get the portals as soon as possible. The last big thing that they changed in the update is um, the adding of buying items in bulk. So um, you can now you can now buy a standard of five blocks, and you can actually right click um, to buy either one, five, ten, half a stack, or a full stack. So there's no more uh, jitter clicking. Wait, can I pull this off? There's no more jitter clicking needed. No more waiting. You can simply buy in bulk. Um, those were basically all the uh, 0.6 changes that happened. 10 minutes ago, uh, I decided to make a video on it. I know it's not the most fun video because it is 12.23 a.m. right now and I can't really be super entertaining, but I still wanted to show you guys all this information um, and show you guys um, you know, what's in the update log without you guys having to read it. You know, there are a whole bunch of bug fixes as well and just uh, items where they change the values. Um, so Speedster set now has 30% bonus instead of uh, 35 spirit spirit uh, mask now has 7% speed instead of 5 etc etc but those numbers are not really interesting um, if the numbers are actually drastically changed I will uh, tell you guys in the next video um, but for now I hope that um, I informed you guys about the 0.6 update and I will catch you guys in the next video